is there a way to get rid of brown spots on hands besides wearing sunscreen? They only appear on the arms and hands. Okay, didn't we talk about lipofusion? We did. Okay, we did talk. It's lipofusion. This is, your, this is called lipofusion. It's not melanin. There's two kinds of pigment. There's two kinds of discolorations. Yeah. One is true pigment, and that's the black stuff or the dark stuff yeah. that, uh, that protects us from the sun. That's melanin. Okay, and melanin, by the way, is found inside the body. Cells mm -hmm. that make melanin are the ones that cause the most, among the most deadliest cancers there are. Melanoma yeah. is a, mel a melanocyte, a melanin-making cell, a melanin cell, uh, a cancer. Um, then there's the second pigment, which is one that gets collapsed once again because we don't, you know, think we don't really learn about what our skin is. Uh, it, it gets collapsed as melanin, but it's not melanin. It's a completely different thing. It's called a pigment, but it's not really a pigment. They're called aging pigments. A pigment is technically something that absorbs energy and uh, somehow changes color as it absorbs energy. It absorbs all the colors and then reflects a few so it looks green or red. That's what a pigment is. Okay. Pigments green, red, blue. These aging pigments are more like debris. They're waste from dead cells. You know, when a cell, cells are constantly dying and being born, right? So there's constantly dying, there's constantly being born. So what happens when a cell dies? You know, if a cell's dying all the time, what really happens when a cell dies? Think about it. A cell is a living thing, it's, and, and it's tiny, but, but blow it up in your mind's eye, and you'll have all of these parts, and they're gooey, and they're globby, and they're moving, and they're Shrivels throbbing. Up and and oxidizes and dries out? I don't know. What, how oh, does a cell it, die? Exactly, right? We should know how a cell dies. Yeah. A cell dies. When a cell dies, it explodes oh. and it spews all of its contents out. <laughs> Ew. It, yeah, it expl <laughs> that's that's kind of cute, right? It explodes and it spews all of its contents out. Luckily, yeah. there's other cells that scarf everything up, okay. that digest everything up. And there's other cells, and, and some of the parts get recycled, and some of the parts get go into the lymphatic system for, for, for uh, uh, removal out of the body. You know, there's a whole kind of process that goes on when a cell dies. And if it happens once in a while in a controlled fashion, that's okay. But when it happens a lot, and when the lymphatic system, which is the drainage system, the sewage mm -hmm. system that gets all the waste is starting to get sticky and clogged up, and the cells are, are breaking down faster than they could be cleaned up, and the other cells are sick, and they can't really pull everything in, the debris doesn't get pulled away. You know, and when, you're yo when you're young, you don't have this problem. But as we're older and as life kicks in, the debris, the cells are not as efficient in their debris cleaning, and there's more cells dying, so waste can accumulate. Okay. That waste doesn't get, that waste tends to be, it's not water soluble, water soluble stuff rinses, it's kind of sticky. It's fatty and it's sticky and it's, it's almost like caramel, caramelized from a molecular standpoint. It has a sticky nature to it and over time it'll start to accumulate. Well, guess what? It looks brown and when you see your brown spots, that's what you're looking at. You're looking at the accumulation of cell debris. It's called, it has a specific name, it's called lipo. Fusion, mm -hmm. L-I-P-O-F-U-S-C-I-N, and it's found throughout your body. It's especially found in, in, in skin, for sure. The, the body has a tendency to want to dump stuff off and concentrate it when it doesn't use it. So it'll stash stuff away in fat, in the skin, mm -hmm. in the nails. It'll, it'll it especially likes the, ex, the external parts of the body because it's a way that it can get rid of things. So it'll stash waste material in the skin, it'll stash it in the hair, it'll stash it in the nails. You know, nail fungus is an example of this, I think we might have talked about that before. And so what you're seeing in the skin is the body stashing of lipofusion, okay. of, uh, of cell debris that it can't get rid of. So what you want to do is, number one, you want to focus on why, and again, this is all internal. There ain't no, there, even skincare companies don't pretend to get rid of lipofusion, but what they do do is they'll they'll encourage you to believe that melanin and lipofusion are the same thing. Okay. They'll encourage you. They won't tell you that it's not the same thing because yeah. they're going to sell you the, the, fa the fading things. Okay. They'll say the sunspots. Sunspots, And that's why right? people it think... It ain't no sunspot. Yeah. No, it's not a sunspot. Okay. It's an aging... They call them liver spots. They used to call them liver spots. Mm -hmm. Whatever it is, it's lipofusion is what it is. And you could tell by its disorganized... It, it tends to be lighter than melanin. Melanin will kind of slough off. You know, you ha ever had a hyperpigmentation where it kind of sloughs off mm -hmm. over time? You know what I'm talking about? If you yeah. get a blotchy skin, it, it sloughs off. But if it's not sloughing off, it's probably lipofusion. You're okay. looking at lipofusion. Okay. Okay, wonderful. Okay. So that's an internal so that's thing internal. once again. Oh, so how do you do? Lymphatic system. Move the lymphatic system, number one. Focus on 
generic or, or general building, uh, building uh, 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 anabolic or building strategies and anti-breakdown strategies. Remember, I don't. we probably talked about this. I don't know if we did. The body's always in this constant state of breakdown and build up. Have we talked about this? This is a, one of the major, this is one of the most important things to understand about all, well, all of life, really. But certainly, all of the uh, all of biochemistry in the body is that there's a this balance between breakdown and build up, breakdown and build up, breakdown and build up. You know that's that's called thermodynamics in physics. And you know the greatest physicist of all time until quantum physics came around was Isaac Newton, Sir Isaac Newton. And his whole big thing was there's a certain way that real that energy is, and, and one of the principles of it is it's either breaking down or building up, uh, and it tends towards breakdown. Mm -hmm. So he called it entropy. The body is always in this constant balance between breakdown and build up. What we call aging is really giving in to entropy. Mm -hmm. When we're young, we got lots of chemistry going on. We're, we're full of the life force. We can resist entropy. Do you follow what I'm saying? We can resist breakdown. But as we get older, that doesn't happen as much, and that's called aging. So what you want to do is you want to build your body up so you don't have to deal with this excessive breakdown mode. So if you if you notice you have lipofusion, you're in you're net in the red, you're net breaking down. Okay. You want to reverse that. You want to start doing building things, uh, things like pro, more protein, less inflammatory foods, coconut oil, uh, essential fatty acids, minerals, the mighty ninety essential nutrients, exercise, relaxation. There's zillions of strategies for doing it, but the point is is that's how you want to focus. You don't want to say, oh, I got this brown spot, it's so uh, yucky, you want to say, well, hey, I'm breaking down now, let me start to reverse, right. this, reverse this process and see how I can build. Well, guess what? It's a little bit hard to build because you're going against entropy. So most people, most of us have a resistance to wanting to do building strategies, real building strategies, real anabolic strategies if we don't have to. And we're always looking for an easy way out of doing real building strategies, right? Yep. We don't, we, hey, I don't, maybe I have this pill, I can lose the weight here. Yeah. Or I can, you know, or maybe I can rub this cream on and, you know, maybe, the, and it'll disappear. We have a resistance to, because it takes energy, yeah. to, to going against entropy. It's very satisfying when, once you accomplish it for beating entropy in a way, right. but most of us don't have, you know, we, and I'm including myself in that too. You know, we, we're, we were, our body will not work if it doesn't have to. It's a very economical system. It is not going to expend <laughs> any energy. <laughs> I get that. I get that. Yeah. <laughs> <All right. laughs>